this Saturday night, I'm having a party, and I want you to come to it. And I looked at him, and again, I didn't want to be rude, and why go through the whole rigmarole of truth where I look at him and go, I gotta tell you, I don't really like it that much <laughs> to come to a party. So instead, I went with the lie. And I go, wait, wait, wait hold on, wait, when's the party? And he goes, Saturday night. I go, guess where I'm gonna be Saturday night? At your fucking party. <laughs> and he goes, he goes, yes, I'm psyched, dude. He goes, dude, I'm gonna let people know you're coming. I'm gonna make some calls and say that DC's coming by the party. I go, you know what, call him twice, cause I'm on my way. <laughs> of course, Saturday night comes along, and I'm not gonna go to the party. I'm not interested in the party. He even gave me directions. He's like, dude, let me write down the fucking directions to my party. And I was like, and I said things like, uh, yeah, let's see those directions. I need to be directed, because I need to know where I'm going. Here's the thing, too, and you know this. When somebody gives you directions, don't you get so anal about their directions? They give you the directions, and the entire time driving, you're just cutting down their directions. Or you're like, just, okay, take a left at the red house. That's fucking maroon, you idiot. <laughs> Why is it this street you're looking for always has a tree from the Mesozoic era growing around the sign? <laughs> you're looking for like Mount Vernon and all you see is like the N and you drive by going, that was probably it. <laughs> you think that was it? That was probably it. There's always the point in the directions that they always write in parentheses. Uh, if you hit the train tracks, you've gone too far. And right when you read that, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> 